you want to become better at scripting in Roblox, I have the three easiest ways that you can practice scripting by yourself. Number one, you want to make something new. I'm not saying make something completely unique, but create something that's new to you. This will help with skill progression. By challenging yourself to build something you've never attempted before, you'll naturally expand your skill set. For beginners, this might mean starting with basic mechanics like creating a kill part or a simple obstacle course, but more advanced scripters can explore complex systems like more in-game shops, pet systems, or even other game mechanics like that. This will also help with problem solving. Every new project will come with its own set of challenges and you'll encounter problems that require you to find the solution, which is a great way to sharpen your skills in both problem solving, critical thinking, and once again with skill progression. Now the whole goal of this is to try and make whatever you're going to make without referencing or using a tutorial. So for a kill part, Try learning what the dot touch function does and then try and go from there and see what you can do. That's basically the whole point just to see what you can do, if you can do it, and how you can do it. And that way you can start to lean yourself off tutorials and you can practice scripting like that. The second easiest way to practice scripting is commissions. Many people think they shouldn't take commissions unless they're already professional in a certain skill, which does have some truth to it, but for the most part this is false and I disagree with it. I think commissions are great for practice as they provide an opportunity to work on real projects for others, which can not only significantly enrich your portfolio, but taking commissions can also be financially rewarding which will help with motivation. Not to mention that you're also getting the experience of working on the project itself. Last but not least we have the object browser. The object browser is an indispensable tool in Roblox Studio, offering a comprehensive catalog of every function, property, event, and more for each instance in your game. It serves as an excellent resource for both beginners and more experienced scripters, providing several benefits for effective practice. Comprehensive Reference the object browser acts as a detailed guide. It's super easy to search and explore the characteristics of different instances within Roblox. This is particularly helpful when you want to understand the available methods and attributes of an instance, such as the properties, the events, the functions, etc. This one may be a little controversial, but I'd say it can also help with scripting ideas. I think that it can help inspire creative script ideas because as you explore the various properties and events of different objects, you might discover new ways to interact with and manipulate them inside of your game, such as finding out that in fact there is a dot touched function, or for example maybe the destroy function could be used for all sorts of different cool things. So if you combine all three of these super easy ways to practice scripting, I bet you'll learn scripting incredibly fast, combine that with my beginner's tutorial on YouTube, and soon the advanced tutorial it's going to be releasing, you will be a scripting pro in no time. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure you subscribe. It helps out the channel a ton and is absolutely free. So make sure you do that if you'd like to. Other than that, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.